Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to Gene Forge. Uh, it's been quite some time since I played here. Hope I remember what's going on. Um, I do remember that we're talking to Elra here. Um, I was thinking about not accepting any of the three servile factions, but somebody pointed out that I'm already pretty much allying myself with Elra because I'm I was ratting out all the what you, the spies to the different villages that we made and met up with. So I might as well just go ahead and join the awakened and do all that good stuff. So at least get the the quest from it so forth. So more okay. I wish to join the awakened. I will support your fight for dignity. Your words and deeds make us feel that you might truly support us. Now, if you perform a bold deed to aid servile independence, we will let you join us and make you one of our own. How can I help you? What sort of deed do you want done? I knew there'd be a quest here. North of here, west of Craig Valley, is another Shaper Ruin. This one is worth... It, this one is in worse shape than most. Blech. It is full of rogue roamers and an intelligent and evil village named Warp. Well, I remember we talked about him somewhere. It, its ambushes have slain many serviles. Warp is controlled by, by an old but still living servant mind called Control 4. It hates intelligent serviles. It wants to destroy us. If you can destroy it, we will be much safer. Do this thing, and we will gladly make you one of us. Hmm. That's all for now, thanks. New quest. Alright. Let's go ahead and check out those quests. Maybe. Yes. Current quests. Um, that should have been completed. I guess I talk to him again? Anyway, destroy the Control 4. The leader of the Awakened, if you join us, you must only with my blah 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 blah. And we're not doing that one. The main quest is to get off, fight a boat, and then those are the merchants, and we still don't know where that knife is. So, I guess at this point, we're on to trying to figure out where the next stop is. I don't want to go that way. Let's see here. Swan again. Um, sort of training for you survive. You did this before, but can you teach me? No, because I'm technically I'm not part of the Awakened clan yet until I do the the quest, I guess. So let's see. I currently have some essence. I may go ahead and summon another one of these guys. Total cost 17. Sure, let's summon another one of those. So let's see. Level 8 versus level 7. Wow. Um, I may as well absorb these lesser ones. Go in there and come back, and we'll redo our... So let's go over here, because I know this will heal me. Travel to Valkyrie, Valkyrie, whatever his name is. So, now, we want to get one of these guys. Do 
is now still level four. Hmm. Evolve creation. Interesting. Can I have all this guy too? Yeah, he's got two skill points. Now let's put those into dexterity in there. It's a lot cheaper than actually. Maybe? I don't know. Hmm. Well, for now, I'm just going to go ahead. I guess because I know magic shaping more that these are higher level. So we're going to go ahead and get a couple more of these guys. Oh, it's taking too long. Okay, there we go. More artillery. Must have artillery. Great. Take everybody, make sure everybody's in. That looks good. Sure, why not? Okay, me and my army of creatures. Now I think crowbar is around here somewhere. We'll talk to them just to make sure and see. I have delivered the message. I expect to be paid for my time. Wow, that's a bit excellent. The message was not so important, I think, is the fact that you have now met Elra. That was very important. I think that we all have much to learn from him. Still, here you are. He hands you a small pouch. The more we learn of the strange things happening on this island, the more we feel that it is a very good thing that a shaper has arrived. I can still use supplies. Any other dangers? Any other quests I can do for experience? I suspect that another of the creature spawners has been placed near us. If you go north of Wachill, you will find a hilly region we call Crag Valley. We have a true treasure here, a rare artifact the shapers left behind when they fled. Destroy the spawner, and the artifact is yours. Okay. So, we have another spawner to get rid of, and we gain some experience from doing that fetch and carry quest. Um, do I have any skill points? I do have skill points, okay. So yeah. Um, I don't know if I want to put more into shaping at the moment. I might put some more into mechanics. Or I might try to get some more essence. I'll use a sphere charm. Evading and missile weapons. The problem with statistics over there is that they're expensive. All cost five. I could put some more into actual magic, spellcraft, makes all spells better. Um, why don't we get some leadership actually and get some better conversational options? Two in there and one into mechanics. Um, except I'm still encumbered pretty easily. Well, for now, I think that'll do. Next level, perhaps we can put up a piece of strength, get some carrying capacity so we can carry more loots. Because as it is, we're near capacity already and not really carrying much at the moment. So. Okay, let's get out of here and head up to, I guess, Craig Valley is next on our list. Still don't know where that knife is, but not a big deal if we don't do it, I don't think. So, up here is the dry waste. Over there is Craig Valley. And then we have the thorny fan over here, which must lead to one of the other cities. 
so let's go let's go to the Craig Valley like we were planning on it. So Okay. Our typical thing before we do anything else, let's go ahead and save fifteen. We have some bandits. I think. Where did we enter? Now entering Craig Valley. Why are these guys attacking us off of the bat? No, this says they're friendly. So who is attacking? Aha, uh -huh, Mr. Rogue Salad. And he can't shoot anymore. So let's move him back over here. And let the other guys take care of that salad. Or let that guy take care of that salad. Wow. Increasing their levels makes them even better. Wonderful. Okay, so... Who are these people? Somebody come in and talk to me? Maybe? Or they're... leaving? That's strange. This servile is unwilling to meet your gaze. Whether she is afraid or angry, though, you can't tell. She keeps her face well obscured within her hood, with her hood. Greetings, Shaper. I dern, she mutters. How fare you today? Uh, I should no talk. I not talk. I fight. You talk forny, forny talk. Forny, forny talk. Yes. She is silent after that. So, I assume I have to talk to the other servile who left. Talking oh, that's Forney. Okay, there you are. This servile warrior is clearly very happy to meet you. You note that he doesn't seem surprised to see a shaper here. News of your arrival on Cecilia must have traveled ahead of you. Welcome, I am Forney. I am one of the guards of this pass. I am honored that you are visiting our lonely post. As he bows to you, his robes fall open slightly, and you notice that he is wearing a beautiful chainmail vest. Iron. Er, well, does it actually say what material it's made out of, but usually chainmail means metal of some sort, so. Okay. Let's see. You seem pleased to see me. I was raised to honor the Shapers, for their wisdom and for creating us. I have been taught that I must always have faith in your kind and follow them without question. Hmm. I approve of your loyalty, but we are not infallible. We can make mistakes. He looks uncomfortable. Your words have not reassured him. Yes, Shaper, I, I will try to understand. He stares down at the ground, confused. Okay, so these two must be from, was it Pentil? The, what are the... Oh, I don't remember the name of the faction, but either way, let's have another question. That is beautiful chain mail. Thank you. It is a Shaper artifact, passed down and carefully maintained by my family. So here I can try to beat them up or take his armor, which would be probably way too heavy for me anyway, or I can just say it's very good armor. So I'm going to say it's very good armor, because I can't carry that kind of stuff anyway. I'm not a fighter. It is very good armor. Forney looks pleased. Thank you, Shaper. Okay. Um, why are you posted out here? My friend Dern and I are charged to keep this pass clear for travel. We are but one link in the chain that connects Valkyrie to the west and Pentil to the east. Of late, however, our post has been a dangerous one. The nearby lands are infested by rogues. At times, they emerge and we must beat them back. Like that salad we did right before I talked to you. It is a mystery. We do not know why so many appeared so quickly. I think I know what is making the rogues appear. Describe the spawners. 
As you describe the horrible beasts which can generate these hordes of monsters, you look very concerned. Oh dear. Dern and I can never fend off something like what you describe. Shaper, if you could use some of your awesome powers to destroy those who threaten your creations, we would be ever so create grateful. Yeah. Tell me more about the area to the northwest. I'm glad you asked, Shaper. Dern and I have spent some time sneaking among these woods. However, there is a ruin out there we have not been able to enter. He points due northwest. The ruin is full of artilla. Oh, boy. And we never fight those things if we can avoid it. I don't blame you. It has two exits, one at the southeast corner and one in the west wall. The west entrance has very few rogues around it, while the southeast entrance is crawling with artillery. If you can find your way to the west entrance, that might be a better way to enter. Mm. See, I have another question. Where can I travel from here? Due south is the keep of Elra, the founder of the Wicked. I am an obeyer, so I avoid that area. Obeyers. I was looking for the obeyers. Versus the takers and the Wicked. Okay, right. And west of there is Valkyrie, or Valkyrie, or Valka, whatever. I don't know why that gives me so much trouble, but every time. Anyway. If you leave here and head east, you will enter the Hills of Jars. Okay. Beyond there lies Pentil. However, the route is a difficult one of late. Uh, let's see. What is an obeyer? A wise sect. Yeah, sure. Based in Pentil, which believes that the shapers are right and true and wise in all things. If you went to Pentil to give us your blessing, your kindness would overwhelm us. Right. So. Okay. Um, why is the why is it killed the car called the Hill of Jars? Because the warrens there contain many jars. I thought there would be a better description for that, but I guess not. Okay, why is the route to the east so difficult? To pass there, one must go through a warren of shaper tunnels, possibly old warehouses. Recently, all of the doors in the warren closed, we know not why, and the passage was blocked. Of course, one with the awesome powers and wisdom of a shaper would have little difficulty clearing the way for us loyal serviles. Interesting. Um, that's all for now, thanks. So, a couple of bears... So, I am going to save. Come on. Because I don't like the sound of... Click. Why am I going to let me save on that one? Strange. Well, let's save over the first one there. Okay, so, 